Welcome to a one-step dosage calculation. You are preparing an injection of morphine. The order reads for 15 milligrams IM. The stock morphine is 48 milligrams per two milliliters. How many milliliters must you administer? We're going to solve this using a proportion where we set two rates equal to each other, cross multiply, and solve for the unknown. Notice when we cross multiply, A times D will equal B times C, as long as the units of A and C are the same, and the units of B and D are the same. So looking at the given information, we'll start with the fact that the stock morphine is 48 milligrams per two milliliters. This will be our first rate. So we'll have 48 milligrams per two milliliters. Next, we want to administer 15 milligrams IM, so the second rate will have an unknown, this will be 15 milligrams per an unknown number of milliliters, which we'll say would be x milliliters. Before we cross multiply, notice how the units on top are both milligrams, and the units on the bottom are both milliliters. We do have to have common units before we cross multiply. Now when we cross multiply to form our equation, we will leave off the units. So we'll have 48 times x must equal two times 30. Well, 48 times x would be 48x, and two times 15 is equal to 30. To solve for x, we'll divide both sides by 48. So we have x equals 30 48 but this will simplify. 30 and 48 do share a common factor of six. 30 divided by six would be five, and 48 divided by six would be eight. So we need five-eighths of a milliliter to administer 15 milligrams of morphine. Let's also show how to convert this to a decimal. A fraction bar means division, so this would be five divided by eight. Well, there aren't any eights in five because eight's too big, so this will be a decimal value. So we'll put our decimal after the five, move it up to the quotient, add a zero, and notice how there would be six eighths and fifty. Six times eight is forty-eight. Subtract. This difference is two. Add another zero and bring it down. And there are two eighths and twenty. Two times eight is sixteen and we subtract. That would be four. Add another zero and bring it down. And finally there are five eighths and forty. Five times eight is forty. We subtract this difference would be zero, so we stop. So to answer the question, we need to administer 0 0.625 milliliters of morphine, or five-eighths of a milliliter. I hope you found this helpful.